Loyalty or lust? Will her boyfriend cheat with another woman? It's another UDY video. You know these loyalty deaths, they be having my blood pressure way up, man. So let's lock in. My chair is squeaking. I'm ready to go. Let's do it. I'm about to have a stroke. Why you can't play the game correct? Why you gotta be greedy and eat all the damn food? My God. As much as I don't want to say. Got the bubbly. Yeah. Like today we're placing Crown's boyfriend to a loyalty test. Wait, we're getting straight into it. No. Our friends Madeline will be testing Sean's loyalty by hitting on him. Lord have mercy. We must stay focused, brothers. I'm just admiring the sights, man. It is what it is. I'm a, I'm a gentleman at the end of the day. Let's go. Will he remain loyal? Or will he entertain Madeline's advances? I always hope that they're not down. Like, I'm sorry. But also, like, we better free our homegirls from their boyfriends, you know? Damn, man. Hey, baby. What's up? Did you get my text from last night? Which one? The, the one about picking my charger up from my friend's house. What about it? Uh, I was just calling oh damn, he's short with it. You don't forget. Um, can, did you check like how far her house is? Damn, he's short with that phone call, man. He's already at that stage where it sounds like he's over it. God damn, at this point, just let it burn, let it burn. It shouldn't be that far, honestly. Uh, just make sure she told me she'll be home or she'll be free, like between three and five. And actually, I'm gonna give you her number. And um, yeah, I'll text you her number after, and then you can, you know, just kind of like facilitate that whole thing with her. Okay, sounds good. Thank you so much. Um, my boss is like right in my ass right now, so I have to go. But I love you, and right. thank you so much. Oh shit. Okay, I love you. Love you too. Okay, got the love you too back. Oh my goodness. I used to work at. Mm -hmm. um, I had another friend who also worked at. Of co-workers or whatever um and she worked in a different she looked good though him, but she would tell me that there was a girl who did work in his department who at first it was just kind of like whatever but then it ended up being like they were really friendly with each other mm. and i don't know as somebody who's in a relationship i just right uh, raised right. red flags <clears throat> yeah asked him about hey, amen the relationship what was going on there if there was something at all the workplace is a dangerous it's a dangerous location man there there be some serious activity going on in the workplace let me tell you man i feel like the libido be it 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 be speaking to some people differently when they're in the office i don't know why maybe it's because you see those people more than people in your actual life so now you start to like you know but you always got to watch out for the coworker man the coworker is the second husband slash wife um and he said that they were just friends everything was cool you know um so well, does your friend say like they flirt a lot or how does well let me just be honest she's biased because she's on my team so yeah she she really does she, make so it seem you know like she bit, does yeah. yeah she says they flirt all the time biased so, friends like, are dangerous too man and on their life like hey like oh you happen to be eating lunch let me sit down it's like here we go oh, again <laughs> I hate to pause back to back just like this, but bro, I really don't like biased friends, man. I'm the kind of person where like, if you dating somebody I know, I can edit. When I see something that, that my friend is doing, I can own up to that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I won't, I won't like, you know, sabotage my friend, but I can, I can acknowledge when they are doing some crazy shit. But if you're dating a girl and she got biased friends, ooh, shit, man. And it's a person that can't take accountability. GG's, you're cooked. Lunch is together, right? And then multiple times, like, okay, one little lunch, whatever, right? Yeah. But then it's like, if I'm hearing like this is a consistent thing, like, yeah. are, what the f is this? You know? Yeah. Mm. I wanted to test her boyfriend's loyalty because she's been very suspicious of him talking to or cheating on her with this coworker. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, yeah. His now ex coworker. You see, Sean eventually left that job, but he's still hanging out with the old coworkers and talking. To oh, he got fired from and. I was low-key happy because it was like, okay, now you don't got to deal with the girl. Okay, that's kind of suspect, to be honest. He's hanging out with the old co-workers. He's going to bars with them. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. All type of like that. And she's there. Is, she, is he inviting you, though, to go And he's out? not inviting me. Oh, no, that, that's it. That's cooked. That's cooked. for a fact that when he goes out and hangs out with the co-workers that she's there? Yeah. Have you met her before? I never met her. Mm. Did you think to confront her ever? Like, yeah, but at the same time, it's like, if I don't know anything for certain, I can't just... Yeah, you, know I mean? you got to wait for the hard her. facts. I'm not, I'm not, I don't have an issue with her. For sure. You know, for as much as I know, she don't even know he's in a relationship. Mm. But it's him. 
Yeah. He needs to understand. She got it. Relationship, right. and that's just not how you operate, you know. And you said that one of the reasons why you want to trust him and you almost don't want to do this is because he gives you access to his phone. <laughs> he gave me the passcode a long time ago, and I, I don't know. I just never. God damn, man. <laughs> Now, let me just say, the signs are all there. The signs are all there that bro's f***ing up tremendously. But, God damn, what, like, what, woo, you gave the passcode. He on a whole different level, man. He he got the cheat code. Bro gave her the password, access to the phone. So, he must have, like, a, du a, a double, got another phone or three. I don't know what he's doing, how he's getting around it. Or maybe that person only contacts, contacts him, sorry, through Discord. And he got noties off on Discord type shit never used it you've never checked this phone i've never gone through his phone oh I, I, one i just feel like i don't have she to never went through okay 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 and the other thing is just like i feel like if you're so adamant about me checking your phone like you're so open to it then you probably deleted the shit you don't want me to find you know of course now i feel like i should have checked the phone yeah. but yeah whatever we're here whatever the outcome is i'm gonna accept it i've given him a lot we've had so many conversations i've sat him down so many times and just being like like just be honest with me you know He's i got a little crush on madeline i can't lie to you man i, I might have a little crush type shit but it's fine lovely well, that just don't add up with what you're saying and you know you know how people talk about like oh this is my work husband you know stuff like that you literally Yeah, get your no, truth, my girl. Feel free to do whatever, okay? Like, okay. Whatever you feel like will tempt him. How about it? She said do whatever. Wait a minute. Are you 50-50? I'm fully 50-50. Fully 50 /50. I don't know. I genuinely do not know. Apart hey, listen, she rocking them braces nicely too, man. Like, usually when I see braces, you know... I mean, no disrespect to braces wearers, but it, sometimes it, 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 it removes me from the immersion. But she looked good with braces, man. And she gonna look better when she take them off, too. And that dude, he gonna regret playing hooky the way he's playing right now. Me, you know, really trust him, but we wouldn't be here. If yeah, some people would say that doing a loyalty test would be like a break of trust as well. It is. Today, this is... It's something that I'm doing for, you know, the sake of saving my relationship. I don't want to just let it go or just go cheat, you know, and just go. I don't know, man. I think I would just make the executive decision. Like, if you got to think, you already have your answer. For sure, but she doesn't have solid, solid evidence yet, so. So you come in. Madeline began communicating with Sean and narrowed down his arrival time. We needed to control exactly when he would be coming for him to arrive. I'm scared. Scared? Yeah, I don't know. Like, this is Crazy. Oh no. That's the thing, right? Like I, I always had that thought where it's like if you gotta if you feeling weird and you gotta start questioning shit and you can't and you don't feel and it, it doesn't feel right to ask them because you don't feel like you'll get what you want if you ask them, you feel like you gotta sneak and, and like find it out in action, you gotta go, man. That ain't no really that ain't no way to feel in a relationship, in my opinion, man. It, it, me personally, I wouldn't do this. I'll just make that executive decision. If I was all, if I was wrong, I'll live with the regret. If not, I trusted my soul, man. It is what it is. After waiting for another 30 minutes or so, Sean had finally arrived. Shit, man. Jeez. Hello? Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm outside. Okay, uh, can you come to the door? Here we go. My heart rate just increased. All right, sounds good. Okay. Sounds like a swell dude, though. I couldn't even see. He drives a black car. Madeline makes her way to the front door to greet Sean. She carries a glass of champagne in her hand. The idea is that Madeline's been daydreaming Tom fit. the release of her new music, so her job is to act a little tipsy. Hey, how are you? Madeline. What was your name again? Sean. Sean. Come on in. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Here we got him over. That's good. It's a good first step. Sorry, that took so long. I was Hi. getting more champagne, and I'm here with my team right now. This uh, is Sean, guys. Yeah. He's here to get a charger. Yeah. Madeline introduces Sean to her supposed team. Okay. Music producer Nathan and her manager Kyle. If you guys recall, to narrow down his arrival time, Madeline told Sean that she had a meeting with them that would wrap up by the time that he got there. Congratulations on your new project, on your drop. I'm really excited yeah. to see that. I'm going to send you some more beats tonight, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, Lord. Here we go. Project. Let me yes. think of them. 
jacked up a little bit. And then I'll call you later with the numbers and how much everything's gonna cost. Okay, sounds so good, guys. The dress is crazy too. Jobs. A small role, but critical in getting Sean over at a certain time and also making sure that the rest of this test would be believable. I wish I knew that Crown was sending such a hunk to come over to get the charge. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can we take in, can we take in this isn't her first rodeo and that she's too damn good at this? She is too good at playing interested, man. I would have gotten ready a little bit more. Look pretty ready to me. Look Thanks. Good. Would you like a drink? Okay, good dude. Good man. Keep it going. Uh, I usually don't date drinks, but we're celebrating. We're celebrating. Get the charger, bro, and leave, please. I don't know. You could, can you keep a secret? I really want to tie you. I really want to tie you. But you have to keep a secret. Okay, you have to pinky swear. Oh my pinky god. Okay. I'm one of these, yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, come here. And it's art B. Yes. Okay. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Cheers. I'm literally like so. Get excited. the charger and leave, bro. Whoa, calm down, Jamal. <laughs> Would you be down to hear a song? You know what? Actually, no. You hear a song, you tell me what you think, because I would love to have your opinion, and then I will give you the charger. It's like that. It's like that. Oh my God. All right. I need some extra ears on this, you know? I can spare some time. Yeah. And it looks like I don't have a choice anyways. <laughs> okay, let me just get some more of this. Oh, no. You sure you don't want to drink? Yeah, okay. okay. Keep it pushing, bro. Keep it pushing. Madeline just needed to execute it flawlessly. Are you positive that the password on his phone is still the same? I'm not positive, but I, I'm pr almost. Okay. Should be should. Okay. The. Oh wait. Do you have your phone on you? Yes. Okay. Can you leave it there, please? Why? Because I don't want you to like be secretly recording and then possibly leak my news off. I'm not gonna leak. I, I'm sorry. I just don't trust you like that. I don't trust you like that. Please, just leave it right here. Seriously? Please. I don't lie to you. I can't lie to you, bro. This is suspect. I would have been like, look, I'm sure your song is a killer. It's it's busting. It going to hit the top of the charts. I'm just here to pick up a charger. I ain't trying to do too much, bro. Give me the charger and I'm going to leave. You got a busy day ahead of you. I got to go, man. Leave my phone on the desk. The f*** you trying to do? Shoot me? Strangle me? God damn, man. Listen, man. Hey. I'm so serious. Let me see. Make sure you my wallet chill. Oh. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> I'm, sorry. I'm so sorry. Come on in. Madeline takes Sean into the office, oh, closing shit. the door behind her. You can sit here. I have a speaker over here. Okay. Let's let them start. This is crazy. This the setup is weird. Madeline successfully manages to convince Sean to leave his phone behind so that he wouldn't leak any of her new music. In reality, though, we simply wanted the crown to have access to his phone. These songs, this whole project is based around a love interest. Our music started. Oh Wait, is she is she actually an artist? Because if that's the case, I imagine everyone that's been on this show be leaving negative comments on their music, man. That, that's a risky thing to do. Madeline, we also want to help Crown find out what the relationship between Sean and his ex coworker was. Her name is Evelyn. Are she and Sean really just friends, or are they something more? I mean, remember, guys, Evelyn was the whole reason why Crown wanted to do this. All of this to go through the phone, though. That's it's kind of crazy. Yeah, yeah, we Once we do this, there's no going back. Oh, oh, my gosh, it died. Okay, I'll put it on my phone. Here. Now, I think many of you would agree that we should have followed Sean and Evelyn around and found out if they were hooking up. Remember how his phone is, okay? We considered it, but in the end, we didn't want to spend possibly weeks stalking them to hopefully catch them in the act. I can't lie to you, bro. This... This is a okay, okay, okay. This is a lot. And just like that, we were into Sean's phone. Now we didn't want Crown to go This is a lot. We wanted her to change her name with Evelyn's, delete both of their message threads, and then text Sean something with, hey babe, dot dot dot. We would then get Sean to look at his phone, and he would hopefully think that it's Evelyn. His response to that text would tell Crown everything she needs to know. You don't have to read anything if you don't want to. So, Evelyn, is it Eva? 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 He's an Eva. Oh my god. He's an Ava. Is it her? 
surprisingly, Crown couldn't find an Evelyn in his. Bro, this is too much. Was an Eva, which could have been short for Evelyn. This is too much. I can't lie to you. Like, I get it, but this is too much. Madeline continues playing more music to buy us more time. They, they talk. They, they have full conversations. What the? F Let's see. Okay, but do you see how some of these? I think he's deleting. Sh do you see how like some of these are? There's so many gaps. Like he said this yesterday, right? This is too much, bro. I, I can't lie to you. Oh, he sent him. Oh, he sent her money. I just saw that. Like at this point, just break up with the dude, man, because he going to see this and y'all going to break up anyway. Like at this point, the relationship is over. And as far as I'm concerned, at this point, it's done. It's cooked. In trying to figure out if this was or wasn't Evelyn, Crown inevitably ended up reading some messages. I didn't want to show them because I wasn't sure if this was even his ex coworker, but their thread was interesting. There were gaps between messages. Okay. So Sean and this Eva girl didn't text each other very frequently, or Sean was deleting messages. Don't. Oh my God, this is this is stressing me out. Are you sure this is Evelyn? Evelyn. Oh, I think I'm, I'm, it's gotta be. I don't blame Cran for. This is all alleged, man. This is assuming. The reality, though, is that Sean may not be deleting messages. That doesn't mean that he and this girl aren't communicating in some other form, though. The, the problem with this is we don't know who that is. That could be a cousin. That could be a sister. That could be. That, you you need something more concrete, man. This is looking crazy. I can't lie to you. This is looking crazy. Like. It, there's some the, the 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 breadcrumbs are there like there's some fuckery afoot most definitely but you need something concrete this is all still assumptions man i'm good i'm done i'll, I'll see you i saw and if so switch ava's name to my name yeah once you do it there's literally like no one back like he's gonna know yeah. what you did eventually he's gonna figure it out yeah, I'm just gonna do it. yeah it's, it's over Cron was convinced that eva was short for evelyn and that sean was deleting messages so she moved forward with our plan just delete your thread too oh yeah and with that our mission was accomplished all we had to do now was send sean that text by the way shout out to madeline for holding him there she actually did drop some new music guys that was a part of the test but not an act go check it out and download it okay later. she's an actual she's artist like oh yeah i can tell that she's got a little freak in it mm. he's like set me free you think he's deleting they could also be like voice chatting or like they're communicating like stop it sergio it's like a phone call stop or it or snapchat or something and then... i didn't even think about that <sighs> i should have checked all his Part of me honestly felt bad, guys, yeah. because Crown had held off so long and not going through Sean's phone, and our plan low key made it go through his phone. Now we had her in her head about even more things. Yeah, Maybe it's it cooked. Nothing, this is cooked. Either way, uh, just the fact that they're like texting back and forth. Yeah, I don't know how to feel right now. Oh, we should probably just prepare the text that you're gonna. Oh, okay. Um, <sighs> Fuck, this is cooked, man. I'm gonna say, hey, babe. What you doing tonight? What Maybe you... not the tonight, because Madeline's about to ask him. Oh, him why. yeah. So, hey, babe, what you doing? So he might get suspicious. Okay. Don't tell me that. I'll let you know when it's Just hold on to it. Yeah. I swear to God, if he responds something like... Ideally, he should say, Who the f***, babe? Who the f***? Oh, this, this is bad, man. This is bad. I just hope he proves us wrong. Because he doesn't seem to be like, you know? He seems to just want to leave. Because you want your charger back. Uh, you're actually really talented. Uh, I would listen to that. Yeah. There you go. He said he's a fan. Eight, 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 eight. Winning hearts, winning souls. Eight, eight, eight. eight. <laughs> okay, charger. I was only supposed to show you one song. It's okay. Uh, I, mean, I gotta get you out of here. <laughs> Let me get that charger for you. Okay. Prepare to send the message. He's gonna grab his phone right now. Uh, I think it's in the list. Oh, my heart rate just spiked. Oh my god. Kitchen. Can we go check? Thank you so much, though, for taking the time. I know you're probably busy. Do you have any plans later? Um, no plans. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Hold on. We're not done here. I just want to make sure you're not. Oh. Oh, okay. I think you got this is your phone. Yeah, this is your phone. You got a text from Ava. Check your schedule, too, but I have to use the restroom. So give me a second. Oh my god. Yeah, my heartbeat. And so with that, our plan was done. Crown sent the text. Madeline made sure that he saw it. And now all we had to do was wait for his response. I'm over to have a stroke. 
I'm about to have a stroke. Is he texting? There's no doubt about it. Sean saw the text. The question was, what would he reply? Okay, I'm not gonna pee. I don't want you all to hear me. I really have to pee though. <laughs> Sean was on his phone, but no text was coming through. And he responded. He's not responding. No, he's just looking at it like. You think he's catching on? Mm, he could. At the same time, like, I don't know. This man really went radio silent on us. Like he's on his freaking phone. Matt, like, <laughs> the message. He saw it. He My boy looking at it like. <laughs> like there is fuckery of foot right now. What the f does she mean by babe? I as now to be fair. He could be like, what type of time is she on today, babe? Imagine it's his cousin. See, and that's why I'm saying this is too much. Like we don't, we just don't know who Ava is. Ava could be his aunt. It could be, it could be anybody. Imagine it's his aunt and his aunt just said, babe. I just wish I would, the contact switching it. it I wish they didn't do that. Right. That's where it just kind of crossed the line of sanity. It, it, it got, it went from your paranoid to this is kind of nuts. He's seriously not. He's on his phone. That's what I'm saying. He saw it. He's on his phone. He's not. It's like I know you saw that. <sighs> Come on, Sean. Nah, this is ballistic. If it's an emoji or a confused question mark, something to tell us the dynamic between you and this other girl's relationship. Okay, I'm really gonna go pee though, guys, because I gotta go. <sighs> Sergio, you demon! You just want content. The only reason I can think of him not responding is that he's suspicious of it because he doesn't want the messages. And hopefully he thinks that he deleted the thread. Mm. That's true. I didn't think about that. That line is pink. <laughs> so maybe he's like suspicious about that, but. Sean didn't text back. Okay. Uh, Got it. Madeline gave it three to five minutes before going back outside. More than enough time to take a piss and for this man to reply. I thought we were going places. So sorry about that. Just we give the man the charger. The between him and this Eva or Evelyn girl, I mean, if they're even the same person, but at least we are gonna learn if he would be willing to go on a date with Madeline, which honestly still says a lot. I'm gonna have half a glass more. Give him the charger. Keep the party going. We are. <laughs> So did you get a chance to check your schedule? Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm down to like hang out. I, I'll be done like around eight. Maybe we can meet like at nine. Yeah, I mean, what do you wait, wanna do though? Wait a you minute. stay here or you wanna go out? Oh, probably just stay here, have some more champagne and we can like chill in the jacuzzi. That, that's her friend. <laughs> few other songs I could show you so maybe I feel like for this bro like that's already a fail that's done there was no hesitation that means this, he's doing this all the time the fact that Sean was down to hang out with zero hesitation does say a lot he probably already sensed Madeline subtly flirting with him and he was with it maybe this is why he didn't text anything back well I mean it's none of my business but who is Eva 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 okay, she's just a friend she's just checking in to see what I'm, uh, I was up to just a friend ladies and gentlemen we got him we got his ass we got his ass oh we got his ass he goofed he goofed he's cooked the breadcrumbs were there now how the methods we use to get to this point ballistic ballistic the contact switching was insane but we took full control over ava we 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 hold up <laughs> We did identity theft to get the truth, essentially. We used identity theft to get the truth, and that's why it's kind of messed up. That's why I, I... That's why I thought it was weird. Now, he could have said it's my aunt, my cousin, but he said just a friend, and now that we know the contents of the message, and that's just a friend, bomba glad. Bro, this girl is your girlfriend's friend. Are you that ballsy? That you're... Now, there is a very slim chance, a very slim chance that he thinks this is platonic for some otherworldly reason, man. And, and that, chance is, that, that chance is like 0.5%. Let's see what he does. Okay. I mean, I just don't want to step on any toes, you know? I'm like, obviously, 
obviously Crown is my friend. Like I, when she texted me earlier, she's like, hey, is it okay if my BF comes and picks up my charger? And like to me, I didn't click to me like, oh, is it boyfriend or best friend? You know? So I was like. I mean, we're a thing, I guess. Mm -hmm. A thing. Like, what does that mean? It's complicated. You know, like, mm. <laughs> just said it's complicated. Like situationship, talking, uh, dating. You know, it's like we're on, we're off. Oh, okay, so it's one of those. Yeah. Mm. So are you guys on right now or off right now? Like, would she care if we hung out tonight? No, I mean, we're just, we're just hanging out. Yeah, but what if, like, something happens? Like, God damn it. Why you can't play the game correct, man? Why you can't play the game correct? Why you gotta be greedy and eat all the damn food? You want the cake and you want to eat it too, god damn. I felt that, bro. I felt that for her, man. I felt that for her. I felt that for her, bro. I feel like loyalty is non-existent these days, man. I, I, oh, man. Loyalty is non-existent, man, especially with technology and the accessibility of just reaching people like you could be talking to somebody and they could have a dating app with like 50 different niggas or girls in the DMs waiting to meet up. IG DMs flooded. Damn. None of my business, and I can care less, you know? I just, like, don't want to step on anyone's toes. No, no, we'll be fine, you know, we're just, we're just hanging out. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm just saying, you never know what's gonna happen. We're gonna be, like, in the hot tub. It's like, if we're gonna be drinking, I'm not gonna let you drive home, you know? Like, you're Wait obviously a minute. more than welcome to stay. Okay, so she wouldn't care. I didn't say that, but... He knows. He knows he's wrong. Like, mm -hmm. He can't he even say it. Answer, yeah. Man. He can't even say it. If it was my girl saying <laughs> like that, bro, oh my god. <laughs> Bro, like, bro. Oh my goodness, bro. I'll have to leave the city for a weekend. I, I, I would not be able to look at her face, man. I, I would have to leave the city. I'm going straight to jail. Okay, well, I'll see I'm going straight to jail. But it would be smoke, man. Yo, the demons inside of her right now are ready to go ballistic. Don't go for the hug, please. Oh wait, is that the one with the wait, can you see it? Oh wait, that one's mine. Oh. Man. Ugh. Let me check in the room really quickly. This has to be here something. You can come with me. Can you help me find it? I don't want to keep you much longer. I'm really sorry. Give me all over this. <laughs> you know, alcohol makes you forgetful. Yeah. Let me check over here. I don't know. Where would it be? Where would it be? Yo! No! No! They caught him admiring the yams, the gets. Yo! She caught him, man. No way. Mm, I wish we could have seen his face, man. I know bro was like. <laughs> to Sean checking Madeline out. This man was not just looking, he was also licking his lips. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's rubbing his hands. Oh my gosh, but now that I have you here, really, really quickly, I totally forgot to show you something. Okay. Madeline initially gave Sean the wrong charger so that she could bring him back into the office and show off her merch. With the correct charger now literally in his hands, though, he can leave. There is nothing holding him here anymore. Unless, of course, he wants to be here. Interesting okay, trap. Okay. I'm going to give you a little fashion show. <laughs> okay, he's got the charger. He can now leave. leave. Go home. He doesn't have to stay anymore. He does not have to stay anymore. He can take off. So I have two designs. These are just like, mo like, like test mock-ups. Mock -ups, like, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna show you the, my least favorite. This one. Oh Lord, I'm. Oh. I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, this is this one. Here's the thing, right? I hate that I'm pausing so much, but I gotta interject, man. I gotta interject. 
I would never be in this place this long with a girl under the influence as a black man. Either this nigga got no brain cells in his, his head or he just that ballsy man. As a black man, I will never be in the house of another woman by myself. There is too much risk, man. There's too much risk. There is too much risk. I'm telling you, it's not worth it. As soon as I find out you're under the influence, I'm at the door and I'm saying, hey, please get the charger. I want to head on out. You ain't going to say I did nothing to you. Mm-mm. You ain't going to put that on me. So this nigga brave. This one be for the boys. So I'm Madeline Monet. I know I didn't tell you that earlier. That's my artist name. It's also my real name. Which is oh, that's the Govy? Thank you. Okay, you want to hold it? Check it out. This one is my favorite. This one's custom made, though. Okay. This one also says Time is Monet, but it has like. Uh, that's a cool one, Time is Monet. Like all over. Yeah, it's like a mini dress. Oh, that's a dress? It is. <laughs> Don't say put it on. Hey, I want my girls to feel bad. You know, like, I mean, you listen to my music, it's like. It's sexy, boss, 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 like sensual, lover girl. Not the boss. It's pretty good. Can I? No! Oh my god. I've never seen that. I, now, I've, I've watched quite a few of these UDYs. I've never seen this kind of physical contact. Bro, she just cranked this up to Grandmaster difficulty, man. This was at Diamond Rank. Now we at Grandmaster, my nigga. We got booty on the thigh. Bro gonna get bricked up. Oh, my lord. Listen, I'm afraid to press play. I can't. <laughs> I'm afraid to press play because this. Oh, I hope he don't go for a touch. This is Grandmaster difficulty, my nigga. She's sitting on his lap. What the? This is why we wanted to give Sean the charger before Madeline ultimately sealed the deal. This man had a chance to leave, and even now he has a chance to push her off. Whoa, did he put his hand on her back? Yes. Hold on, let's go back. We gotta go back. Run the replay, please. How would you take it? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Chance to push her off, but he doesn't. No way, yeah, yeah. If I was this girl, it's demon time. I'm sorry, it's up. It's demon time. It's time to get my first charge, man. I'm going to jail. It is what it is. I am going to jail. Today is the day. Mama, I'm sorry. I followed the law, but today it's not happening. We going to jail. It is what it is. It's time, man. It's time to get on that. It's, it's time to get on the record, my girl. It's time. How do you take this? How would you take it? Hi. The hand placement is insane. How does Madeline do this knowing what it's about? There was no point in continuing this any further. I mean, Sean told Madeline that he and Crown were complicated, that they were on and off. He was down to hang out, he was down for whatever's, and I know Madeline was the one that sat down on his lap, but he could at least say something. Yeah. He chooses to put his hands on her waist. That's way too comfortable. Bro, why the f is he letting her sit on his lap like that? Right? He's enjoying this a bit too much. Oh, he probably thinks they really gonna smash. This is ridiculous. This is the end. Oh, God. Yeah, I don't know how we, I don't know how we have many words right now. Do you see a point in continuing this test to like a... I mean, like... What more do you want to see? Like, at this point, I feel like I don't need... Man, why you doing my queen like this, man? Look at this beautiful melanated woman. What you doing, bro? Hey. Let me tell you, man. Shout out to my queens, man. Listen, don't hey, don't worry, man. You see all of that 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 melanin beauty. Listen, man. If he gon' fumble, I mean, my <laughs> hey, hey, come on over, man. The water's just fine. <laughs> the water's just fine in these parts. You know what I'm saying? We got some a little bit of salt in the water, blue seas. Come on over, man. Come on over. You got all you need, man. I'm like, yeah. I don't care. I, I'm like, I'm just, just leave. Don't even confront him, man. Is it hot here? Like, is the I'm fine, honestly. Oh, you're fine. Okay. Well, look how he's looking at her, though. That's crazy. How is he looking at her? I want to see. 
No. Fuck him about everything. Yeah. Still want to do that? Yeah, I do. Did you still want to do what we talked about in terms of you going out there without the cameras and kind of like go without the cameras to see what reaction he gives you first? Uh, and then the cameras come out just so he doesn't like freak out. Yeah. You know, oh shit. Okay. Oh shit. It's complicated. Remember, we can just see you until you call out without okay. the cameras. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? What? What, what are you doing, what? mister? I'm not that tipsy, boy. You can't have your way with me. Kyle Nathan, we are ending this here. I will walk you guys when to come in. Okay, perfect. Madeline? Oh, yeah? It sounds like it. Um, you want to come out here? Do you want to... Come on. He's so confused, he has no idea what happened. Hi, hey, boo. What are you doing? Come on, I to Yo, see this you. is some fucking thriller hey. shit. How are you? What's up? Why are you acting no, weird? I'm chilling. How are you? <laughs> are you chilling? Why are you over there? I'm here. Come here. You're like, I'm good. sit down. Oh, shit. he looks guilty as fuck. Oh, he knows. Oh, he's scared. Sit down. Like, what is so... What's up? Can I get you a drink, girl? Please. <laughs> so, what's up? What you doing? What's going on? I just, I just came to get the... You got my charger. Yeah. Thank you. He's either really confused or he knows exactly... Bro, you could cut the tension... ...with a damn hammer. What? That's how tight it is. You could cut that bitch with a hammer. You don't even need the knife. You could cut it with a damn hammer. But the way, I can't lie to you. It was kind of scary the way, the way he came out and, and how it was shot. And she's sitting there with the, the, her legs crossed. Hi, boo. Like, wait, what the fuck kind of movie is this? God damn. Am I in like act three of some horror movie? Yo. So for 10 minutes, you've been looking all over the house for this and nothing was going on. It's a little dry. I don't know what to tell you. It's your friend. Okay. What? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? I just, it's your friend. Like, what is all this no, hostility? Like, you're I'm a little like, defensive right now. Like I don't, I don't even understand. Like, I'm literally, I swear what's, to what's, you, what's, I'm what's, just trying to understand. I am just trying to understand. You told me to come get your charger. Right. I have your, it's right there, right? It is right here. Exactly. So, like, what's the problem? The gaslight is insane. She could have brought that mother charger to the door. Oh shit, we get we gonna let it play. Okay. I, I promise y'all I'm done pausing, man. Every single thing you said is a lie. We just gonna let it play from here. We're gonna let it play from here. It's all gonna be real time, but just know I got a lot of shit I wanna say as it's going as this is going on. The gaslight is ballistic right now. Bro. Don't he knows. He knows why she's there, he knows. Are you serious? Okay. So quick question. Quick, I'm just yeah. curious. Are we together, in your opinion? We're a couple, not not wishy washy. Like we are together, we are that a couple. Together, right? yeah. I don't know. I'm asking you. You don't got to do all that smart ass. Shit. I just want to know. Madeline, let them talk. We're together. If you see yeah, us yeah, as I a couple. Yeah. Hmm. Why are you interrogating? What's this? You, you told me to come get your charger. I'm here and I'm interrogating you because you're lying. I'm lying. What do you mean I'm lying? Because you're lying to my <laughs> face. Now you've been lying to my face. I'm not acting. Are you dating me right now? You got me fed up. Her acting insecure. Why didn't you leave? Look, I don't gotta answer your questions, man. Like, what is all this? I was sitting on your lap for like five minutes. That's how you operate. I don't know That's how you do it. I didn't do that. What the fuck, yo? Some time, Are you serious? I tried to give you like multiple chances to just kind of tell me what the happened. And I told you what and happened. And you told me what the happened, uh -huh. but it was all a lie. And you know how I know it was a lie? You know it's a lie. Because I have a whole entire camera crew watching you. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We got to pause right there, man. We got to pause right there. This is where it's going to come off as, I guarantee you, he's going to use this as a, a way to say, or to justify his decision and say she's crazy she's tripping in this scenario this is where you just can't win with udy man the camera thing is ballistic it is next level it's one of those things where as soon as you find it out it's like ah this is nuts but it's justified let's see how this goes but i guarantee you he's gonna use this as a way to gaslight further let's go we were watching you the whole time all right let's go 
<laughs> He's like, oh my god. I knew you were lying. No, I, like, I really wanted to. No, that's good. Like, but. Yo, what the f? You've been lying to me. Okay? Bro, also, like, question who's, who's Ava? What is this? No. Bro, you did all this? You feel like you did something? What the f is this? I don't feel like I did. You did some f. Dude, like, what the f? Who started from the door? Like, I'm freeing my homegirl. First of all, mm -hmm. you're sabotaging her relationship. That's what you Am I sabotaging or did you, you sabotage it? Did. You were the one with I all the compliments and touching me. Oh, the gas. Nah, I gotta pause. Nah, the gaslighting is insane. Bro, this is some D1 gla uh, gaslighting, man. This nigga. Oh boy, it's time to unleash the demons, man. She, uh, pick up that charge. Let's go. Call 911 preemptively because shit about to go down. Touching you. First of all, what would I have? Madeline's on it. My friend's boyfriend. Are you kidding me? You did it. You, really, you, are really, you are really sitting here after I Bro, watched get that camera out. No, no, no. No, 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 listen. No, you've been on camera all day. It don't, it don't matter. You have, you are sitting here. You are sitting here getting defensive. Because y'all are lying. Getting defensive as Oh my God, he's a blatant liar. Entire, from the moment you walked up to that. Bro, what the f is this? Can y'all stop? Can y'all so, stop? <laughs> can y'all stop? No, we're not stopping because you're cut. So, so Sean, so just so you know, this entire thing was just a loyalty test. Like your girlfriend wanted to find out if you were loyal to her or not. She felt like you were talking to your coworker. She knows about Evelyn, Ava, when, a Evelyn. She knows about your coworker, Evelyn or something. And she thought that you were obviously cheating on her with her. Bro, I don't know you like. None of this was real, basically. Everybody was in you on this, basically. Your text no, this. no, 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 no. Oh, stop Go set this whole up. Cause you're so full of you got me f***ed up. You won't even own up and be like, yeah, I f***ed up, bro. What the f*** is wrong with you? You won't even own up and say I f***ed up. You're playing f***ing games. Like, this I'm is playing f***ing games. I'm not like, it wasn't even real, so I wasn't even gonna cheat. Like, okay. you're just me. Nah, bro. What the f***? What? what is this what is cheating? logic? What is cheating, what is cheating? What is cheating? I'm sorry. Because if I'm sitting on another nigga's lap, how does that feel? What's that? So if, okay, bet. So if I go, okay, bet. So if I go sit on another nigga's lap, what's that? Just saying goodbye? Another bet, I'm about to go say goodbye to hella niggas. Back. I should throw this in your face. Don't do it. Don't do it I'm a good Keep it civil. But you got me hella up, bro. Real nah, y'all are crazy, bro. <sighs> so if I go sit on another nigga lap, do what you want. You know, you what's that called? Up, right? So it's like I guess we're over already. Do what the you want. Hell bro, yeah. Get that camera out of my face for real. You don't gotta be here if you don't want to shine. You know. We're no, just... you don't gotta be here. I, 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 I don't. No. I don't. I don't. I don't even know why the you are here. Hey, Take this goddamn you stupid ass charger too. Oh my god, he got me so up. Oh my god. Bruh. I, the neighbors. He was sincere about it. He was like, okay, you know, like I did f up. This happened, this happened. Okay, that's one thing, you know what I mean? But for you to try to make me feel stupid after you did all that, like bro, that kind of gaslighting, it exists, bro. I, I feel like I went over this in a previous video and it gives me PTSD every time I see it. Avoid those people, man. Avoid. Do you see what this did here? Like, you get to no resolution, my nigga. You don't get to the solution because they, they, it's like, you know, those cartoons and animes where you're in the, in the, the, the lost woods and you can't find the exit because the damn trees are alive and the, the trees keep moving when you try to find the exit. That's what happens here, man. You never get, you're just in a relationship of pure toxicity. Avoid these people, bro. I'm telling you, avoid them. You look stupid. Oh my god, I'm so high. Oh my goodness. Madeline. Oh, oh, okay, girl. Listen, man. W video. Is that the end? It is. Fantastic video, man. They got straight to the point. Like, the whole thing was engaging. It was stressful. The way they went about doing it was kind of next level, man. But thanks to that. They were able to uncover layers upon layers of lies, man. He had a meticulous plan set up to where even if she went into the phone, she ain't gonna find nothing. She had to go through hoops and ladders. If she, now, granted, if she didn't go through the video, she may have still been in that relationship feeling weird. But here it, it boils back to what I said earlier. And this is a logic I use now. Sometimes I'm right. Sometimes I'm wrong. But if I feel it in my core, that I got a question what's going on. Like, if I don't feel an unconditional reliability and trust in the person I'm dating, I'm scratching that. I'm gonna have a talk and say, listen, 
And I, I did this recently, actually. I, I did this quite recently. I'll say, listen, something feeling weird, man. I don't know what it is exactly. But I got to bow out because like this weird feelings killing me, man. If you're if you're feeling any morsel of strangeness, any morsel of doubt, there is a 97 percent chance there's reason for that doubt. But your brain is putting it together and not your heart. So it's one of those things where you kind of have to like when the, when when your when your gut, your brain, your physical body gives you that rush to say no this is it you got to listen and trust it right away because as soon as your emotions get back in you're gonna be like oh but then we were this and we've been through this and that and you'll never get through it i did that recently i had to break it off with somebody the next day i was i was deep in my brain man i was like yo did i make the right call was i overthinking this that and the third but at the end of the day you want to be with someone who doesn't make you doubt so that's what I'll tell y'all from this, man. You don't need to go and get Sergey, Sergio, sorry. You don't need to go and get Sergio. Trust your gut, man, because sometimes it's onto it. But I'm going to head on out, man. If y'all have been enjoying this content, hit that like button, sub up. Your boy is doing this on, uh, 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 I was going to say a daily, but I ain't going to put myself in there because sometimes I need a break. I'm going to see y'all later, man. Have a good day. Have a good night. I'm going to see you for the next vid. Peace out.